Providing documentation for a worksheet is not something that a lot of users are concerned about, but at different times it's going to be useful if you can indicate to someone that there's something unusual in a worksheet or you simply want to make a comment about how the data is being stored or how a formula works. You can add a comment to any cell. Comments typically are not displayed on the worksheet, but can be as needed. For example, in cell G2 here, maybe this number isn't final or you're not sure about it, and Jennifer is the one in charge of making sure that the final numbers are accurate. So you might want to add a comment to this cell. If you're using the menu system, you'll go to the review tab and possibly choose new comment. Recognize that it also has a keystroke shortcut, Shift F2. So we want to add a comment. And what you're likely to see is your name right here. And you can pretty much type anything you want. So I'm going to type, for example, see Jennifer regarding uh, the uh, accuracy of this number. Good enough. And if you click outside of this, it disappears. What we see in the cell, though, in the upper right-hand corner is a red triangle. And anytime you slide over a cell with a comment, you will see the comment there. Now, if you have more than a few of these, you might want to see and eventually print this too, but you also have the option, you can get to this a couple different ways. We could right-click on the cell and actually show hide comments. In other words, make it be visible. If somehow it were overlapping other data, we could point to its edge and drag it this way or that way to display it a little bit differently. But it's visible all the time now until we decide to take this off. If we had another comment somewhere else, it'll just add a comment over here. This time, Shift F2. Maybe we'll simply add a comment here. Check with Max. About last year's data outside of it. Now, we're not seeing that one. We might want to see them all. So either individually, one by one, you can show hide these or hide them all, depending on what your needs are. You may or may not want to print these too. You can go to the review tab here, show all comments. That's in place right now. Or show again to make them all disappear. So, it's a handy tool. I've seen worksheets where these are used extensively and sometimes maybe too much, but here and there, if you've got the opportunity to help others who might be using this worksheet understand what's going on or to give them pointers as to what's happening, these are very effective. The red triangles, by the way, will not show up on the printout either. You can, as I suggested, make these appear either on the screen or on a separate sheet as well, too. So think of it as a potential source of documentation and as a way to help others use this worksheet more effectively.